Welcome everybody, I'm Kiran Nujibal aka Shadeslayer with uh, another unboxing here. This time I have a brand new mouse, it's the Acer Predator gaming mouse. Uh, this was uh, something that was given to the winners of the Taiwan Excellence Cup that recently concluded uh, in uh, Mumbai. So that's how I was able to get my hands onto this. This is uh, one of the winners aka Formless, shout out to him for uh, letting me unbox this brand new mouse. So uh, without further ado, let's quickly have a look at what are the features of this mouse uh, before we do head straight into the unboxing, shall we? All right, uh, there we go. It's straight up from the ASO website, says gaming mouse, spirit of gaming mouse. Illuminated pulses, your fingers glide effortlessly, scroll, swivel, slide. A aside from all the uh, shebang there, first things first, the mouse looks absolutely huge. So, it's um, fine for me, I guess. I did do have like huge uh, palm right there, so might be an issue for a certain few people. Another sweet thing is it looks like they've collaborated with uh, Steel Series for this one. There's a lot of Steel Series branding as well on the mouse. The mouse and you move as one. Aye, aye, aye. Tournament grade switches. From what I read, though, these have uh, Steel Series switches. So does look like a collaboration between the two companies. Mm, when control. A lot of colors, mm, customization options, but tech specs, USB, pretty long wire. Nobody uses that DPI now, let's be frank. Switch life, 1 million clicks, other 30 million for the left, 30 million for the right. There's an illumination, some effects, finishing. The thing that caught my eye though, as soon as I got my hands on this mouse was the pricing. It's This is pretty much the global store and it says uh, $80. But uh, the package that I have over here, you can see it says rupees 9999 if I can. Yeah, so uh, 9999 is pretty pricey for a mouse. So I was like, okay, the uh, Actual price might be a little different, so I uh, went into Amazon and I couldn't really find a proper price here. The only price I could find was for the uh, mouse from the global store, and that was 8290 plus import duties. And uh, it's pretty much going to work up to uh, 8,500 rupees, give or take. And that is one expensive mouse, considering that. Uh, the uh, store in the US uh, priced it at $80. So we'll see. Let's for now, though, let's quickly go into the unboxing. There you go, the box of gaming mouse. Let me just quickly bring this back. Yeah, there we go. So uh, we have the mouse, as you can see. And. Uh, let me just adjust this back as well. There we go. So uh, 
at the back it says one ms response time 200 ips up to 6500 cpi true one is to one tracking movements zero hardware acceleration 30 million switch click lifetime versatile profile switching right-handed ergonomic grip and precision control hmm. friendly tuned performance adjustments close connected id so let's quickly go ahead and see how this mouse looks shall we has a very nice opening case here as you can see that's the mouse and the mouse is actually pretty huge it's like my hand takes up pretty much the entire thing as you can see it is massive I, So uh, let's quickly open this up and see how it actually fits on my mouse pad. There we go. Pretty strong packaging. Mm, might have just gotten stuck there with the tape as well. My amazing luck with the uh, unboxing stuff continues as always. Worship no game. That's a good mouse. Good pod. <laughs> this is Johnny clowning away. Yeah, he's gonna get rid of the box. Some additional package. Oh, there's something in the box though. All right, uh, not really sure what this is called. Oh, it's actually a pouch to carry the mouse around. Hmm. They've actually given like a pouch where uh, you can pack your mouse up and take it with you on the go. Be it whether you're heading out for some casual gaming with your friends or maybe a tournament. So they have a nice little pouch as you can see. It's a nice little uh, Acer logo there. Not bad at all. That is that. And uh, the pretty standard manual and cards. Get this out of the way. There we go. That's the mouse. As you can see, it's not the matte finish. It has a rubberized finish. Very nice. Fits very nicely in my hand as well. So, since I do have a palm grip, works really well for me. But uh, yeah, that's the mouse. They say it has lighting, so I'm guessing the panels are gonna be for probably the logo, the sides of the mouse. I'm not really sure where else though, we'll have to see. But yeah, that's the unboxing of the uh, Acer Predator Gaming Mouse. I'll let you know in probably uh, a couple of days time about uh, how it does feel to play uh, FPS games like uh, Counter-Strike, Global Offensive and Overwatch. But for now, this is Shadeslayer signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed this. See you guys around. Goodbye.